begin tonight with a frightening warning concerning changing tables in public restaurants. This is a place where parents may not know that they are putting their children at risk to drug exposure. Someone who used to be drug dependent now sounding the alarm on this. And our Alan Carter reports is getting nationwide attention tonight. A public service announcement going viral on social media. Jessica Wayman says she's a recovering addict and warning parents about those changing tables you find in public restrooms. See those black marks she posted? Those are from burnt spoons. Addicts use these as tables when they shoot up. That post raising alarm shared more than 170,000 times. And we are in a public health crisis. Justin Phillips is an overdose treatment specialist. And while she says this is the first she's heard of this, it's not a shock either. The fact that they're finding it useful to pull down the changing table as a way to prepare their drugs doesn't surprise me. It's sad. I know that it's upsetting to people because that's a place where we put our innocent children. Dove House is a shelter for women battling addiction. And again, administrators tell me this is new to them. But after talking directly to their clients, yes, they say this is a thing. Yeah, the black um, that's on the changing table is someone using um, meth or heroin and heating up a spoon um, that they'll use to inject. Wayman's Post claims the residue on those tables can include heroin, meth, and other bodily fluids, an important warning for anyone using a changing table, but at the same time a warning that this drug epidemic can touch everyone. They didn't wake up one morning and decide to use drugs in a public restroom. Something came before that. And we have to be, as a community, we have to be responsible for changing that narrative and ensuring quality access to care. And I promise you, they're not being disrespectful to the babies. They're just trying to survive. And that picture came from a bathroom in South Indiana, Indianapolis. Wayman says that her post, however, has been shared not only here in other states, but also guys across the country here. And certainly this is something I think that anyone that has kids and sees that picture, it certainly sticks with you.